welcome back to chapter 12 after playing chapter 11 so successfully I suppose this is gonna look much worse I hope not let's see how it goes Griffin's pet doctor today. During the pod wing, I believe. So yeah, I have sneaked in into my own facility. Not exactly my own facility. This is not the TCTF headquarters, as you remember, of course, because this is not that. And now I need to dodge some lasers, because if I don't, there are sniper rifles there, 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 and there. Four places, and they're very accurate. So basically, if I mess up, I'm dead. I need to do it all over again. Fortunately, these lasers are all the same, and all it takes is just memorizing how they go. How they go. And it's nothing difficult, particularly. Just don't mess up the key bindings. And now, yeah, you're already in the next save game. This was the, the the first checkpoint was about half a minute long. So yeah, let's do it. This is actually a very interesting mission. Hey. Is that, yeah, at the beginning, these guys are gonna go for the alarm pretty often. Shit, and there are three guys here. Chill, man. This is actually pretty interesting, seeing how you are fighting against your own guys and experiencing their ultimates and all their moves on yourself. Of course, if they succeed. At this particular moment, I seem to be very, very fortunate with counter-attacking anything they do. And defending myself. Oh, I knew there was something here. I just thought it was... Hi, hypo spray. Um, find your uncle. Yeah, basically my uncle is the only guy that is that is not against me. Soon you will realize what's going on even further. And what I am exactly. This is the mission uh, that shows the truth. What, who you are, and why you are as you are. Sort of something like that. Over here. Here. Yeah. You'll need these ammo clips. I'll go a little bit around here because I know these people have something for me. Of course, this woman doesn't. Uh, the interesting thing is the enemies don't see you, of course, while you while you have this invisibility cloak on. That is that is all logical. No, you won't. But if I remember properly, then the enemy. Uh, the enemies don't see you. Hey, hey, come here. Hey, you can use this ammo clip. But I think all these scientists and these civil people do. I may be wrong. I remember it all. Hey. Ah, yeah, you're better gonna run after the alarm, huh? Come on, try. I hope you learned your lesson. There's nothing there, let's just go for the door and op let's just go for the door and open the next part of the facility. Always check these little spots. Maybe you'll find a hyperspray there that's really gonna help you. Because now everything anything <laughs> the only thing that I have shit loads with me is uh <laughs> is uh red ammunition for my pistols. And if I find Oh, no, no, no. Finally, you counterattack me. What's going on? Why do I keep moving my mouse so much? Kill him. Yes, very good. He has learned his lesson. Oh, yeah, he has... Um, 
the best thing how to deal with guys who has these stun weapons is to when you approach them of course they are going to sh shoot it at you that is natural but the best way ah crap the best way how to deal with them is to jump when you when you approach them because they're going to shoot you and you're going to fall down because if you're going to just run run onto them and they're going to shoot you you're going to stay standing you're going to be stunned and they're going to have the possibility to kick your ass a little bit so basically you should need to just to jump then they shoot you you fall down but you can get up immediately and take no damage at all so yeah hello uncle what are you doing here griffin's men are right around the let me worry about griffin right now i need your help yes you do perhaps more than you know but i'll need my equipment and they will try to shut me out so i need you to reroute the power manually I'm on it. I'll meet you in my lab. Now that is a fine uncle. He gave me two hypersprays at the same time. I suppose that's everything he had overall. So yeah, let's advance. Let's use one of the hypersprays, of course. Sorry, of course. I'm, I'm not gonna have any help from him for a little while again. Oh, and here it goes, they're starting to kick my ass. No, no you won't. Yeah, that was awesome. Oh, come on, get the fuck up. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Um, very good, he saw me. That's very good. I'm just gonna kick, kick his ass like this. To avoid taking any extra damage because I'm gonna play it a little bit safe now and now I have full ammunition stun weapon I know there's an invisibility cloak somewhere here at this side or the other side I don't remember the only thing I know I have to clear three rooms in uh, in every room there's a computer of course I'm not sure why I ran that far okay let's try to get these guys Get up, get up, get up, get up! Very good. Oh, so he blocked my ultimate by not doing anything. Okay. Come on, lady, lady, you're gonna give me something? No. If she's not talking to you, she's not gonna give you anything. Oh. Hi. Here, take this hypo. Thank you. Let's advance. Ah, uh, where is the computer? Yeah, the computer's here. You're gonna give me something? Here, take this hypo. Very, very, very big. Thank you. I know there are gonna be guys coming into the room when I access these computers, so they should be somewhere. I think they will. Oh yeah. Exactly as a oh snap! You you attacked me, although you had a weapon in your hands, and I was basically about to do a cool attack on you too. Very good. Hyper spray. I think there should be one of this. Oh, one of the scientists should have. Oh shit! You have more bullets. Break. Oh, I needed. I wanted to break your neck, as I love to do. Maybe you have noticed. Oh snap! Very good. No, not very good. Good enough. Um, yes, I knew. I knew it. Okay, let's advance to the next room. There's a computer here. This force field, it'll help you. I told you they would see. Oh, but these guys don't see me. That's pretty cool. 
Come on, dude. Oh, yay! Oh, shit. So, yeah, that was a very, very fortunate success. And I need to open the last door. And it might be hey, here. here. Yeah. You can use this ammo clip. If you want to talk to me, that means I have not been here yet. So yeah, now I've opened the big door and now I'm ready to go and experience the moment of the biggest, let's not say the biggest, one of the biggest truths of the game, the big eye openers. Thank you! Very good. I, I'll need these, I know. Um, so yeah, let's watch the movie and follow that because the most information I think uh, goes in this particular cutscene. Hello, Uncle. Get into the chair. Is this absolutely necessary? Yes. You've been out of contact since Shinatama was kidnapped. And I need to know what's going on inside you. All right. Now this may sting a bit. Taking a look at the chrysalis and testing to see how far its integration with your body has progressed. You're stable, but transformation is farther along than I had anticipated. What does that mean? What's happening to me? How much do you know already? My birth name is Mai Hasegawa. You worked with my father, but I don't know what you were working on. The Deoden Chrysalis. You see, your father believed that the only way to save the human race from the poisonous atmosphere was to change them so they could adapt to the new world. Shinatana said that you used her to monitor the growth of the chrysalis. Is there one of those things inside me? Yes. What is it doing? The chrysalis is the hyper-evolved clone of its host body. And as the host experiences stress or harm, it grows to reinforce or replace the body's damaged system. did this to me? You? Griffin forced me to do it. Griffin? But why? Your father and I were criminals, funded by the Syndicate. We couldn't get backing from any legitimate source. They, they left us alone for the most part. We didn't think they were interested in our work. We were wrong. Go on. They had been watching us very closely. And when they figured out what the chrysalis was, they raided our lab. Now, we'd only grown two prototypes based on the genetic codes of you and your brother. My brother? Muro. You gotta be kidding. The Syndicate captured your father and Muro. Now, we had never intended to implant those chrysalises. Well, they had other plans. Where was I? I managed to escape with you. I took you to the TCTF. There was no other way to ensure your safety. And Griffin forced you to implant mine. Why? Insurance? Yes. Now, we weren't sure what kind of mutation the prototypes would produce. Griffin wanted to make sure we had a match for any weapon the Syndicate ended up with. Oh, he's a cold-hearted man. He makes you work for him, doesn't he? Yes, but it's all right. You have been my only project, and I owe it to you to look after you however I can. Murrow and his men, they're monsters. What am I? You are who you have always been. The chrysalis can't change that. The effect of the mutation is influenced by the subject's nature. What? You are changing into a more powerful, resilient version of yourself. But whatever your final form, it is an expression of your true nature. Target acquired. It's her. Help! 
pay for that. You'll all pay. Okay. Oh, that was very unfortunate. So yeah, it's finally time to fight. Come on! Oh, you won that, huh? Shit, fuck you! Prick. You already killed one dude today. No way out. Something cursed. There might be a way. I've gotta make it to the biomatter disposal bats. So basically, yeah, I won't be needing this anymore. I need something more powerful. So basically, yeah, now I need to work for the truth that I finally know. That didn't sound right. Finally, I know what I'm fighting for. That sounded correct. <laughs> Screw you. You still don't see me, do you? Let's try to avoid these guys. Those guys, particularly. Although it might be a problem. Okay. We'll see how it goes. So yeah, this is the basically the whole, whole story. I'm a semi-mutant person. You fuckers! You don't know who you're messing with, and... You are simply pussies. One of the... What the fuck? One of the worst things... Yeah, that's the most unfortunate thing. Fighting, uh, fighting on the stairs. Fighting on the stairs is not as well, of course, not as well manageable as simple fighting on the on the playing ground. But that's just how it happens sometimes. Oh, I was so sure there was something behind it. Sorry for wasting your time. Sue me. Yeah. Doesn't matter that there are lasers here. Shit! Yeah, I just messed up pretty badly because I don't fully remember how I did this the right way. This is actually pretty tense. Okay, the laser goes away. Fuck! Shit! Fortunately, these lasers don't have a 360 degree movement thing. And I would definitely suggest you to get these guy uh, to get this weapon out of these guys' hands because the weapon is one of the most devastating weapons in the whole game, and these guys are morons. I would basically never use the weapon if I would know if I wouldn't if I knew I wouldn't be able to get out of that uh, particular spot. And this is another weapon I don't require. to you. Fuck! 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 Oh. Fucking idiot! You're gonna kill us all! Douchebag. Oh. Shit. Mm. You guys come all come out of all places and it still doesn't help you at all. Stupid moron! No! Well, he's a little bit smarter than I just said, but he still used the weapon too much up close. It's kind of like you watch these action movies and there are these 
I know there's this bad guy and uh, he has his guys that work for him and stuff like that. And come on. There are these guys that work for him. And they are the dumb ones. You know, they're catching an enemy and they have gotten him in a room, let's say in a big house. And they start shooting everywhere to catch that weapon, but they... Shit. They start shooting everything, but they don't understand that there are, let's say, explosives everywhere, and they just blow themselves up. Fuck you. So yeah, this is near, a near end to the mission. Yeah, how very fortunate. Unfortunate for him, of course. So yeah, sometimes the ending of this mission, you know, that place... Oh shit. That place with the lasers and stuff like that uh, tends to be very devastating, very unfortunate for you because... You may mess up with the lasers like I just did twice. Only the second time, I got very lucky and the uh, sniper rifles did not get me at all. And I had plenty of um, plenty of health and extra health to deal with the guys that came after me. So basically, yeah, that's, that's a pretty devastating combination of lasers and strong enemies who can't use weapons for shit, but still can do some major, major, major damage to you and everyone around you. <clears throat> I just hope the chrysalis can keep me alive. So basically, yeah, now I'm testing what this thing inside me can can do, how well it performs in otherwise impossible conditions for a human body. What do you think? Dead. She has to be. Shouldn't we check it out? How do you suggest we do that? Target neutralized, all clear. Exactly. So yeah, end of chapter 12. See you back at chapter 13.